Come back some. Y'all know I'm always here for you when you need me. Always here for you when you need me. Personal readings are available upon request. You are always able to donate to me when you receive a divine message. Okay? You can find everything in the description box. You know how you can read the side effects and the drug interactions on uh, with on these pamphlets for <laughs> these drugs, right? You can also Google what it says on the pill, the shape, the color. Yeah. Ooh, look at the colors. Someone loves psychedelics. They do. If they can get their hands on any mind-altering drugs, that is their go-to. Somebody been talking to demons. That is what I heard. Somebody been talking to demons. Okay. It's a two of cups energy. It could be a friend. It could be your lover. It could be your spouse. But there is a wealth of knowledge that you need to know about this, this man. This man wants to talk to you. I want to talk to you. He could have a, a closet full of sweaters is what I just heard. A closet full of sweaters. Bill Cosby sweaters. That's what the G's just said. Bill Cosby sweaters. And he want to sweeten the deal. You hear me? Whoever this man is, he coming like he an emperor. He coming in, ladies and gentlemen, like he wants to reach the ultimate attainment of love in his personal realm of being with you. He's created this solid foundation of stability and has, you know, derived a certain power and he is well-traveled as well. May have some notches. Some notches is what I'm heard. Nachos, nacho cheese. Nacho cheese, huh? That's nacho money. Prenups. It's not 50 50 because he come in 100. He's coming to serve and protect. Whoever this man is, he could be a Leo, a Taurus, a Scorpio, a Aquarius, or that could be you. He could be an Aries. But he said his stage of completion includes you. This man feels like he's mastered himself along his dash, you know, being separated from you. Even if you haven't met this man yet, ladies and gentlemen, he feels like he's been separated from you. This is a man who is wise beyond his years and he just stepped into a particular power and he trying to make some power play. See, he didn't changed up his pace. His pace. He was, you know, in a fast lane. Get ghetto, get get ghetto boys life in a fast lane. But he didn't slowed it down. Little turtle snail slow. You know, he already didn't sold his royal oats. He scattered his energy already. Mmm. So, he gonna greet you with a, a hug, and it's gonna be the hug that you've been waiting for. You know, I feel like somebody hasn't had a good hug in a while. You need a hug, I'm sending you a virtual hug. This man got a good heart. He is. He, he has a good heart, and he's been balancing out a lot in his life. You know, he's paved these these stones is what I'm hearing. He he's paved this road with some stones, not just you know regular tar or concrete motor. No, 
everything that glitz is glamour is what he is what he is is what he, is what he's gonna show you he gonna rep it he gonna represent he gonna represent and he is not a man I'm hearing who is gonna want to have you kept as a secret but as a token of his heart he feel like now is the time for him to brand just this idea that he has um, to come into um, a union with you. He feeling like he want to spoil you. He feeling like he want to spoil you. He, he, he's so used to, you know, having a by love. That's how he going to come in. Okay, ladies, gentlemen, that's how he going to come in. And he going to be dressed to impress. And even if, you know, you do match his fly, he going to make sure that your labels match his labels. That, you know, he, this is the type of man, if he's going um, to a to a business dinner, he's going to have on a tux and he going to make sure that you have on a dress that is the same color as his handkerchief. Your shoes going to match his shoes, that type of energy. At the, Look, he's trying to complete his life, and he feels like the only way that he can complete his life, you know, is is by adding you. He by adding you. He said you. He said you, 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 divine feminine, you. So listen, ladies and gentlemen, this man is blessed financially. He's very successful, and his key to his success is having a very discerning spirit. He's quick to fulfill his dreams and he going to be quick to fulfill your dreams. Just as long as you get up off your breasty dusty, <laughs> you get on up out the, off the couch, get up off of YouTube and Facebook and up out of messenger and talk tick. Yeah. Yeah. Go on and TiVo that television show is what the genius is saying because I feel like, you know, he just been sitting back waiting. <laughs> he been sitting back waiting. I'm hearing, you know, y'all are acquainted in 5D, but y'all have yet to be acquainted here. You hear me? Y'all are acquainted in the heavens, but y'all have yet to be around one another the way y'all supposed to be. Y'all have been in passing like two ships passing in the night is what the Jesus is saying. Very unexpectedly, you know, y'all y'all have caught glimpses of one another and, and have acknowledged one another with a smile. Maybe like going past one another in a store or, you know, um, stopping at the stop sign and this man and walked across or either you done walked across, you know, y'all done stopped for one another, you know? Y'all have stopped for one another. Chivalry ain't dead. Oh, it's the opposition that's scared. Is what the Jesus is saying. So they're telling me to grab this angel number book, and we gon' we gonna see what's good. What page I open up to? Page one thirty five, and I am seeing in touch. 27 connect with the divine you have an ability to perceive things that are not of this world your angels can let you know that on a regular basis too okay your angels call on you to connect with this extra sensory excuse me <laughs> with this extra sensory skill lie in meditation with your index finger tapping on your third eye chakra the center of your forehead repeat this mantra I see yeah you didn't see me. <laughs> you have seen them. You have. Y'all have crossed paths. I feel like, you know, I don't know, maybe somebody was feeling like they, they weren't up to par. Maybe, you know, you had just ran out the house and you weren't dressed and you didn't even want to look this person's way. Or that could be how they was feeling about you. You never know. But the G's want you to stay positive and they don't want you to overthink shit when it comes to this man who's going to be approaching you. They want you to remove the blindfold. Go on and put your index finger <laughs> Look, you wait. <laughs> Go and put your index finger. We're going to read it again. You, you see. You hear me? 
Yeah, you see. In touch, connect with the divine. You have an ability to perceive things that are not of this world. You're my angel. Your angels call on you to connect with this extrasensory skill. Lie in meditation with your index finger, tapping on your third eye chakra, the center of your forehead. Repeat this mantra, I see and show. You know what? You've been, your angel's been sending you some boss ass energy too. You know, I feel like, you know, you probably, you know, you weren't vibing high. You know, that, that beautiful light that shines from within, you, you, something had dimmed your light that day. And, you know, this person wasn't able to see ye, see you. Yay. Behold is what I just heard. Yay. Behold. You know, getting up off that couch, getting up off, 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 off the phone, up out of, you know, corny corn corn space or, you know, yeah, up out of corny corn corn space. So you can free yourself. Somebody, you know, feels like they didn't have a string of bad luck, so they probably, you know, have, you know, placed themselves in a, in a, what was supposed to be a temporary hermit mode, and it's been long overdue for you to get out and socialize, is what the Jesus saying, and shit, you can kick it solo dolo, I always do, I think it's chic, I like to travel solo dolo too, and this person, you know, they could, or you, they could be, um, Someone who is um, traveling and passing through your neighborhood, passing through your town, passing through your city and state, or you could be passing through theirs after you get your breast dusted up off the couch. Hey, y'all, I used to hop on a plane on a Wednesday. I get off work. I was working this around this particular era, working second shift, get off work on a Wednesday, be like, I'm bored this weekend on a Wednesday. I'm going to go somewhere. And I hop on a plane and I go somewhere. You hear me? Mm-hmm. So that's probably a part of your will of fortune, honey. That's how you gonna level up. That's a big ass change in your life. And I'm seeing you, your life been up and down here recently. Your your feelings. You you know, one minute you you high you high vibrational, you know, and and the next minute you know you you know your 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 energy all fucked up and cluttered and shit, you know, but. You had a lot of twists and turns, I'm hearing, when it comes to your fate. You know, when it comes to you unlocking these treasures, when it comes to you having the key to unlock these treasures. You can see. You hear me? You can see. You can see this rainbow. I don't care what season it is, you can see this rainbow. But somebody didn't want you to know that this was your pot of gold. It could be somebody from your past, too. You could have an attitude with them. They could have an attitude with you. King of Cups energy. Mm-hmm. Y'all both being funny towards one another is what I'm seeing. Then we got this Knight of Swords and this Devil energy. So, yeah. So, I don't know. If you haven't, you know, met this person I'm feeling like you, you know, you have to do exactly as angel number 427 says and meditate because someone has been on a war path because they feel like it's, it's one element in their life that's missing and that's love. You know, and th this is how this man is feeling as well. This man is wanting to be responsible for his actions. This man is a little, you know, pissed off too with this devil energy. Yeah, whoever this man is though, he is topsy-turvy. He has reached a milestone in his life though, ladies and gentlemen. He has. He, he's now, you know, dealing with his shadow side. He's not trying to suppress it. He's not trying to hide it, you know. I'm seeing, you know, with this King of Cups, he, you know, it was a time where, you know, he wasn't, he always had on a mask, you know. He was always trying to charm his way into some into somebody's um, 
world, you know? Someone is dealing with their sexuality, you know, whether or not, you know, this man, um, it could be possibly a woman, whether or not, you know, um, they are worthy is what I'm hearing. It's about their self-worth. You know, they feel like they didn't know their worth or they didn't know your worth. And then when it comes to not feeling, um, like you're more than enough or that they'll fit the bill, you know, this person is half and half, but when it comes to being tenacious in the morning and what it is that they are outlining, I'm hearing when it comes to what's been, it's, it's like, you know, what, what's being resisted. What they're trying to resist. They can't resist you. You hear me? They've been capping. Somebody could be a Capricorn. Somebody could be a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. They've been capping. Somebody could be an Aquarius, a Gemini, a Libra. They've been capping. And what they really want to do was reconcile this relationship. They want to repair it. It's been a lot of delays. It's been a lot that's been stopping them. And that's what they've been dealing with. It's a part of their shadow side. They wake up every day with a new plan on what part of themselves they know that helped to deteriorate the connection with you. What can I do to improve this part of me? They've been real creative about that. You hear me? They a little defensive. But when it comes to this person being a knight in shining armor, when it comes to this person being armed up too, you know, armed up. That can be defensive. It's something like football too. They ready to tackle. You hear me? They ready to tackle. It's like they gonna tackle you when they see you. It's gonna feel like they tackling you. They gonna run and just scoop you up. You hear me? Just scoop you up. They dealing with so much right now too. They feel like the world is against them, so they're a little at the highest point of positivity, but not with you, because they felt like you were against them, too, for a spell. What else, y'all? This person has been through a big, a big transformation and what's been going on in their life. They've had to deal with it on their own, is what I'm seeing. And this person is tired of fighting by themselves as well. Yep, Ten of Cups energy. This person tired of fighting by themselves. So this Ten of Cups and this devil energy, I'm I'm seeing this person waking up with the thought of you on their mind. I'm seeing this person feeling as though they are, were blessed to have you in their life. I'm feeling like this person feels like it'd be a blessing to have you in their life. This person is very compassionate about whatever war path you know, the, these opposing energies and these spirits is what the, is what I'm hearing. These spirits, they feel like they've been spirit, that your relationship has been spiritually attacked. And when it comes to friends, when it comes to friends, it's like I'm hearing, you know, a tender, loving heart, a tender, loving heart. A tender, loving heart. Y'all could have started out as friends or y'all going to start out as friends. But when it comes to this person being very gentle with you, when it comes to this person being in an empire state of mind, an empire state of being and having trust issues, right, is what I'm hearing. Having trust issues. They, they've received some bad advice and they pissed about that. Um... This person wants a connection with you as well. You know, they want to, listen, This I'm hearing two, two different scenarios here. This is somebody who is coming back and this is for somebody, okay? And this is somebody who's going to meet someone, you know? And look, I, I'm hearing, you know, Y'all had a very emotionally, for the one who was coming back, y'all had a very emotionally charged connection. And 
both of y'all was going through some something on y'all shadow side. Y'all was y'all was y'all was dealing and boxing with y'all shadow selves and shit. And y'all fell out and it's 3D, but do y'all know y'all spirits are still highly energetic and connected to one another? Y'all have a powerful connection in 5D. Y'all just can't get right down here in 3D. Somebody could play baseball or somebody could play softball. You hear me? And I'm also hearing, you know, when it comes to high intelligence and a creative intelligence, someone could um, be in the military. Somebody could uh, very well so um, be like a professor, like... um. Yeah, like I said it, like a professor, science, biology, or something like that. But when it comes to the law, when it comes to the, to the laws that was written, I'm hearing, in your town, it's something... Someone, when it comes to the laws that's written in your town, okay? There's some intimate details about, like, protective orders or protective orders or a man who is of the law could be, like, the police or something. I'm seeing you, you know how they say a man coming to cover a woman? This man come coming to cover you, lady. But there's something going on with his heart. Yeah, something going on with his heart. Hmm. Queen of Cups reversed. This relationship can be codependent and you can feel like it's karmic in nature, but the G's are saying, no, this is a divine love because it could be, you are going to depend on this man. You're going to lean heavy on him for a particular area in your life. And I'm feeling like it's going to be finances, but you know, it's not going to be a burden placed on him, but you may feel like it's going to be a burden placed on you because he has some health issues. Or, or place the shoe where it fits, y'all. But I'm seeing that this man knows that you're a good woman and knows that you're trustworthy. Um, but I'm seeing this devil energy, too. There's a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, or a Capricorn energy um, who feels as though um, this man is, is diminishing his self-worth. When it comes to dealing with yourself, right? Having to administer this self-care, this self-love, being in the flow of um, restricting yourself from um, unhealthy attachments and karmic relationships, you know, those type of raw desires. One of y'all gonna jump start a spiritual journey because someone is on someone got off of their spiritual journey you hear me yeah somebody got off of their yeah somebody got off of their spiritual journey and you are there to resuscitate that you are there to speak life into this person but just as you speaking life into them they're gonna be working on you too this is a powerful 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 statement that you two are going to make. You hear me? Honoring one another's successes, honoring one another, period, and trusting in the power of love, divine love, because y'all worked hard on your relationship is what I'm hearing. And then, you know, y'all rethought being with one another. It's like y'all was following some some emotional instincts but you weren't following your 
spiritual instincts and y'all can't forget one another. Y'all can't just place a band-aid over what was broken either, what was cut, because somebody, somebody cut and somebody feel like they was cut deep. You got to see the best in both worlds. Both y'all worlds is what the Jesus is saying in both realms as well. This man, he's gifted. He's successful. Okay. There's some destruction that's going on along his destined path. But y'all paths are about to collide. I'm hearing too, lady, you, you can't be in your feelings about these tricks of the past and these tricks who going to show up could possibly be with kids, okay? But tricks are for kids. Also, it could be one of y'all parents who going to try to show up and, um, and, and got dang, and got dang on, um, have y'all changing one another's minds or coming in and, you know, instead of being silent, want to talk about what went wrong in the past and just try to fuck the church's money up. Okay, now, present day, page of wands, and synchronicity, coincidence, deja vu. This page of wands talk about you getting up off your rusty dusty, getting up off that couch. Getting about that house, getting excited about the creative intelligence that the heavenly realm has been shooting at you like Cupid's arrows, okay? I'm for real. They want you to explore your neighborhood. They want you to explore what you were once excited about, okay? Because somebody is excited about you. Somebody is in a cheerful state of mind when it comes to the thoughts of you. You hear me? When it comes to the thoughts of you and they have a, a idea when it comes to this change, you know, instead of, you know, y'all, y'all energy fluctuating and yeah, instead of y'all energy fluctuating, you know, and y'all falling out of communication. You know, there's a communication barrier and gap. They want you to know, your spiritual team wants you to know, it's somebody from your past who loves you. Um, it's somebody who is considering romance with you, with somebody who feels as though, you know, like I was talking about pills, you are their ecstasy pill. When they think of you, they think of, they think of being successful, being a successful man. You hear me? Oh, yeah. They don't care nothing about too much of material happiness because they got that. They got that in the bag. They got that in the bag for you, but they got a, they got a lot that they need to make well known, especially when it comes to them being a hypocrite. You hear me? They are not self-conscious about nothing anymore when it pertains to the relationship between the two of you and whatever it is that you need for them to fess up about or something that you may have. It was, it was some lines crossed, you know, some miscommunication, or you could have drawn your own conclusions. You know, y'all going to talk about that. Y'all going to talk about mister. Y'all going to talk about the mistress. Y'all going to talk about the family. And y'all going to talk about this faithful love. What you gonna do, boo? See you.